Hey guys, so one type of deck that you will see at FNM will be the Planeswalker, the Mythic Planeswalker deck, where every card is pretty much a Mythic. Deploy the Gate Watts. Four double white sorcery. It is a Mythic. Look at the top seven cards of your library. Put up to two Planeswalker cards from among them onto the battlefield. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Now that's pretty good. Obviously Gideon is probably one of the stronger Planeswalkers. Um, Nixless will probably be very good. Any Planeswalker that costs a lot, you want to use this card to essentially tutor. It's Coco except for Collected Company except for Planeswalkers. Definitely you will get two benefits from the oaths, like whatever oath you have out, that'll trigger. It's very, very good. Like I want to say six you got to get to six relatively fast i'm not sure how you would try to do that but um on the top of my head kiora tamio they're kind of harder to put out planeswalkers but gideon's probably the best right now every single deck is playing gideon uh, nissa is very good and at least until rotation happens you get to play all of the uh, Origin Planeswalker. There's plenty of Planeswalkers to choose from. The new Liliana, you might want to play her. I don't know, six is six is a lot. But you get two Planeswalkers, which should be relatively fun. And yeah, I, I like the card a lot. Um, definitely. Oh, of course, Big Chandra. I was like, what's that six mana drop? Obviously, Big Chandra it costs six anyway. So it's kind of like only upside if you are able to... I revealed that card. So what do you guys think about this card? Are you excited? Are you going to make this deck? Will this be the most expensive deck in standard? Probably yes. The answer is yes.